you were recognized today. I was recognized today. Yeah, I should point that out. Somebody says, I, I know I've seen you on uh, YouTube before. The chocolate be a bit. My God, that was a lot of chocolate. That's a lot of chocolate, yeah. And there's a piece of uh, decoration here that looks like it's gotten broke from the uh, rocking of the ship. Good morning. It is uh, it's Tuesday morning now. It seems that I got a lot better sleep last night. The ship is still moving a little bit, but nothing like it was. And it doesn't seem to be creaking and cracking nearly as much. So that is probably a good sign. Just headed out to breakfast back up to a garden cafe to get something to eat and Missy always likes to sleep in so I usually just bring her back something she's not too picky even though she tells me what she wants but uh, heading up there for breakfast So this morning in the garden cafe here up at the buffet, I've got some French toasts. The French toast up there seemed pretty hard, but this one was um, pretty soft. I was gonna get their waffles, but those were like little hockey pucks, so I skipped that. I have a uh, kind of an eggs benedict, but it's got sausage on it. Some corned beef hash, some sausages, and some hash browns. So we're gonna enjoy that here this morning on the Norwegian Encore. It's 8 o'clock in the morning here on this cruise, and I guess you can consider it a sea day. But usually 8 o'clock is like peak time for the breakfast buffet. And this place is pretty empty. There's quite a few people here, but um, here's some footage kind of behind me, uh, at the back of the ship, where there's only a few people sitting. So it just kind of goes to show you how many people are really on this ship, and how quiet it is, and, and uh, it's definitely not crowded. The Seas seem to have subsided some, so that's a good sign. There's still white caps out there, but it definitely seems to be a lot better here this morning. So hopefully that's a sign of good things to come for our journey as we continue here across to New York City. So I'm out on the uh, balcony. Brought breakfast back for Missy, and you can definitely see out here it looks to be a fair bit calmer than last night. Last night, when we were in the dining room, you could definitely see the waves really moving up and down from the uh, window in the dining room. But today, still kind of choppy out there, and a lot of wind still. But uh, the boat does not seem to be moving nearly as bad. So hopefully, it's a good sign of things to come. As we continue on here, only six more nights to go. Prince, but they, uh, so this is 188 of 200. I figure just because he made 200 of these, he can charge a lot more for them. Yeah. How do we know he really did 200? He said he made 500, number 188. Okay, so we're at Coco's, it's an a la carte, uh, what would you call it, a dessert place, sweets, and they got uh, lots of uh, chocolate candy, chocolate bonbons, homemade gelato, those mad milkshakes look pretty good though, mm, tempting. They each get a different thing. Yeah, they have a Nutella and milk chocolate ice cream, 
it's a cup. Yeah. yeah. Ducking and brownie s'mores, is that the other one you were looking at? Yeah. And they have crepes too. Yeah. Hmm. Celebration platter for $19 feeds uh, three to four people. <laughs> and you, they'll even bring you a mini chocolate fountain. Wow. Hot chocolate. Starbucks coffee. Of course, you can just go around the corner for Starbucks coffee. I think I'm going to get the Nutella and milk chocolate. So I finally got down to the chocolate uh, gelato. I don't know if it's as good as the gelato in Italy though, is it? Mm -hmm. It's pretty good though. This is actually a pretty good deal for eight dollars. Mm -hmm. Three scoops of ice cream would cost you nine. And this is eight, and you get a Sunday out of it too. So we just finished our Sundays here at uh, Coco's, and uh, I'm not sure where, where, where are we off to next. I love it. It's sugar coma. <laughs> sugar coma. Chocolate coma. Love that chocolate, right? It's a lot of chocolate. If you're not a chocolate fan, you probably don't get the double chocolate. Just yeah, saying. I don't. You're a chocolate fan. I'm a chocolate fan, but my God, that was a lot of chocolate. It's a lot of chocolate, yeah. I love mine. You get your money's worth. Yeah, it's the best definitely. value we've had on the whole show. Better than uh, American Diner? Yeah. Better than... Uh, fighting words. Better than the, the local? I mean, that's free. How can you argue with free? Because free good value. Actually, I would, uh, I would I'm that that full. Time. That was a whole bill. Exactly, yeah. So I think uh, we're not sure what we're going to do next. It might be the casino, but uh, I'm not sure. We kind of blew through $10 really fast there yesterday. So we'll have to be smarter about it today. Don't let Missy play. That's it. Hey, I'm not going to screw it up. Well, neither did that I. That was a joint effort. Yeah, exactly. So, that might be where we go next. So the uh, Encore Casino has not been kind, has it? We just uh, blew through another 40 bucks. Seven minutes? In seven minutes, yeah. <laughs> well, maybe 10. Let's give it 10. We were up, then we were down, then we were up, then we were down, and then we were down completely. So we got a souvenir. You got a 19 cent voucher for souvenir. So we've made our way up to the uh, observation lounge here. Just uh, found a seat, and we're going to kind of chill and relax. It is a little bumpy up here still, though. But uh, 
And there's a piece of uh, decoration here that looks like it's gotten broke from the uh, rocking of the ship. So there is a little bit of damage. Obviously, some things will break as the ship moves. So. So you were recognized today. I was recognized today. Yeah, I should point that out. Somebody says I I know I've seen you on uh, YouTube before, which uh, was kind of shocking because all of our 500 subscribers, but he, he probably isn't even a subscriber anyway. But he recognized me. Okay, so we've been hanging out here at the uh, observation lounge, having a good time, relaxing, talking to different uh, other cruisers, right? So they just turned the lights down. For a second there, we thought the lights went out, but they just turned them down to set the mood, I guess. So we are uh, it's about four o'clock. About four o'clock. We've been here over two hours, just uh, just relaxing here at the observation lounge. Watching the sea go by as we sail forth. It's kind of that loud up here, even though it's supposed to be quiet time in the lounge all day. But, uh, we're gonna uh, probably go down and uh, get ready to go to dinner at Cagney's, Cagney's Steakhouse. It's, um, I'm gonna get some steak. Missy's probably gonna get chicken. 